so I'm going to catch you up real quick so you know what you're dealing with in the next few minutes. I've got four kids because my vagina is a clown car. <laughs> Four kids, two ex-husbands, first one lovely Jewish man turned out to be gay. Whoops. <laughs> that happens. Second one, cheater, which is not technically a religion, but he practiced it like it was. <laughs> All right, okay, so you got what we're working with tonight? All right, buckle up, because the shit's gonna get live. Okay. Speaking of hag, I'm dating in LA. Now <laughs> oh, that's magical. All right, it's the land where prom queens go to die. Let me just fill you in. <laughs> when they put a crown on her head, every prom queen in America gets on the first bus to LA to be an actress. Three of them make it. The rest of them are serving you pancakes at IHOP, and they're completely fucking up the bell curve of beauty, all right? So you got a bunch of spoiled asshole guys and a bunch of idiot girls pretending to be purse designers. He's all proud of her. So you got a 60-year-old guy with a 20-year-old girl with three-year-old tits and lips that still have the tag hanging off of them. <laughs> oh, she's brilliant. She designs purses. No, she doesn't. Shut up, Crip Keeper. She does not. <laughs> She's an idiot, and so are you. I dated the young ones for a while, because I got divorced in LA. It's the law. So I had the young boyfriend. And he's, they're nice. He was very enthusiastic. It's like having a puppy <laughs> with an iPad and a 24-hour hard-on. Seriously, no finesse about it. They just poke you in the back, like, did I fall asleep on the remote? Oh, it's your dick. Oh. <laughs> Little too enthusiastic. If I could be helpful, because I like to be informative and funny, young guys, or if you know any young guys, don't get so enthusiastic with my area. Just, can you calm down, okay? I know you're very goal-oriented. I blame video games, I understand. But my area is not World of Warcraft, okay? <laughs> My clitoris, for the most part, is not an orcish death knight. Just ease it up a little bit. Don't go at me like I'm a vending machine that took your change. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> um, no, stop it, stop. So, I went on match also magical and I have a little more advice if you're a guy on match or you know anybody who is stop posting pictures of your motorcycle okay I don't nobody gives a shit I don't want to fuck your bike okay I know I understand your bitch ex-wife wouldn't let you ride and now you're all excited because you get to play let's pretend sons of anarchy I get it you're not a one percenter just stop okay you're not Jax Teller keeping charming safe from the Irish Kings you're Gary Rosenbaum DDS keeping Paramus safe from gingivitis. Let's <laughs> calm down. You want to impress me? Don't show me pictures of your Harley soft tail. Give me a profile shot without a hat so I can see what I'm dealing with hairline wise. <laughs> All right, your girlfriends, when, you, when you're breaking up, your girlfriends will be like your animal, right? Like they're your fucking beast. You just, they support you. And they'll lie to you after you break up, like, girl, you didn't need him anyway. He was an, all your girlfriends, by the way, turn into Cookie Lion from Empire after a breakup. <laughs> you didn't need him, he's an asshole. Me and Tisha both fucked him. He was a dick, you don't need him. <laughs> you can take care of your own needs. I'm like, yeah, but I've been taking care of my own needs so long I got carpal tunnel syndrome. <laughs> my shower massage had a dental plan, I'd marry it. <laughs> the guys are groaning. Ooh. These are masturbation jokes. Look how you clammed up, and I don't use that word accidentally. <laughs> Women are embarrassed to talk about, like, you know. They're, we're embarrassed because we don't have cute names for it. If guys, uh, guys have cute names for it, so they talk about it. They're like, what are you doing this weekend, Jim? I plan on shaking hands with the bald-headed champ. That's when. <laughs> if women had cute names for it, we'd brag about it, too. We'd be like, what are you doing this weekend, Marge? I am wetting down the old slip and slide. That's <laughs> when. I'm feather dusting the Oval Office. That's what I'm doing. I'm finger painting my Georgia O'Keeffe. That's what I'm doing. Oh, thank you. Art lovers.